Whenever shooting or handling any firearm, safety should always be foremost in your mind. And while all of the safety precautions that you follow with all firearms certainly apply to muzzleloaders, there are some additional ones that apply specifically to muzzleloaders. Most likely, the instruction manual that came with your muzzleloader has a section on safety. Right now, we're going to use CVA's manual as a guide to cover these safety issues. Chad, you can start us out with the rules that apply to all firearms. Look it up. It's called the Ten Commandments of Firearm Safety. I'd be happy to. First, always keep the gun muzzle pointed in a safe direction. Be sure of your target and what is beyond it. Never rely on a gun's mechanical safety. Your gun should remain unloaded until ready to use. Always wear hearing and eye protection. Make sure the barrel is clear of all obstructions before loading and shooting. Handle every gun as if it were loaded. Keep guns and ammo separate and in locked storage. Avoid alcoholic beverages and drugs before and during the use of a firearm. Do not alter or modify your firearm. Have your firearm checked regularly by a competent gunsmith. Make sure all parts work properly prior to each use. Thanks, Chad. Now for the safety considerations that are unique to muzzleloaders. Here we go. Pay close attention. Never smoke when shooting or handling a muzzleloader or related equipment. Ashes and or loose sparks may cause powder or caps to ignite resulting in personal injury or death. Always wear eye protection. Flying debris from the breech area and muzzle are always a possibility with any muzzle loader. Never pour powder into a muzzle loader directly from a flask, horn, or any large volume enclosed container. Hot embers in the barrel could cause the container to explode. All powder storage containers and percussion caps should be kept well away from the area where shooting is to be conducted. Sparks from shooting can cause accidental ignition of these devices. Follow all manufacturer's instructions for long-term storage of powder, percussion caps, and primers. Use only black powder or an approved black powder substitute in your muzzle-loading firearms. Never use modern smokeless powder in any muzzleloader. The use of any amount of smokeless powder in a muzzleloader will create dangerously high pressures upon ignition, which may result in severe injury or death to the shooter and or bystanders. Always check to ensure that your muzzleloader is in good working condition before use. Test the hammer, trigger, and breaching lever carefully prior to loading. Check the barrel for any obstructions as any blockage may cause the gun to explode. Use only recommended loading data for the particular model of rifle in use. Different models have different powder charge and projectile capabilities. Improper loading or overloading of a muzzle loading firearm may result in severe injury or death. Never prime or cap a firearm until you are ready to fire. Primer cap should always be removed when walking, climbing trees or fences, transferring the gun from one person to another, or leaving the gun unattended. Never lean or rest a loaded muzzleloader against a tree, wall, vehicle, or other surface. Any fall of the loaded gun may cause accidental discharge resulting in severe injury or death to bystanders. Never transport a loaded muzzleloader in any type of vehicle. A muzzleloader is considered loaded until powder, bullet, and percussion cap are removed. Never exchange a loaded muzzleloader with any other person. Only the party who personally loaded or witnessed the loading of the muzzleloader should fire it. This practice will help prevent overloading or double loading, which may cause severe injury or death. Never store a loaded muzzle loader. Muzzle loaders should be unloaded and cleaned prior to any storage. Never load a muzzle loader without first making sure that it is unloaded. 
exercise extreme caution when hunting from tree stands with muzzleloaders. The dropping of a loaded muzzleloader may cause accidental discharge leading to severe injury or death. Be sure the primer cap is removed whenever raising or lowering the firearm. Never allow the hammer or bolt of a muzzleloader to rest against the cap. Any impact to the hammer or bolt could cause accidental discharge. Never rely upon a mechanical safety. Muzzleloaders should always be handled as if ready to fire, regardless of the safety systems employed. Always use proper cleaning procedures. Firing of an improperly maintained muzzleloader may lead to unsafe pressure conditions, resulting in severe injury or death. Make sure that the projectile is firmly seated against the powder charge. Short starting, meaning leaving a space between the powder and the projectile, may cause the gun to explode. Always keep the muzzle of the gun pointed in a safe direction while loading. Never lean over the muzzle while loading. And there you have it. Now we've covered everything that we need to know prior to shooting. So we're ready to head to the range to load up and shoot a couple of muzzleloaders. I'm all charged up. Let's go. <laughs>